Hello, mate. Oh, can we let them all know the news on the vlog? This is my bed. I'll give the camera to Bill and Luke. All of us in the film is a couple of um, I can't remember what you call them bits. What do you call them? Aesthetics or something. I told Bill he's got a job. He's got to film us getting off the train. He's got to film the Welcome to France sign. That's his job to get there. That's his school work done today. Quick stop. Oh, lovely. No shoes on. I'm just showing them how they need to start and then you come. Hey man. How are you? Hey man. You good? Yeah. <laughs> Can't see the real master. <laughs> are you coming to ride Lear up Sunday? Yeah. That's my house. <laughs> I'm the real sand king, undercover. Yeah, yeah. Just stay undercover. But you're telling my real secret now, Kevin. <laughs> you know, you have me from the side. Those guys always sit like this. Yeah. They really want to be f***ed in their ass, you know, yeah. when they start. But you don't want to be f***ed in your ass. Oh, you don't think? You don't want that. <laughs> no, I also agree. I find that you can use your core better when you roll the hips under a little bit. You like that? When you're like this, you cannot engage the core. That's enough. No filming. No, no filming, illegal no, footage. No being is too busy. This is how I would have my bike when I come to the track after. Where are you well, checking? My laptop side too. I just double checking what you've got in it. Right, on, on, my phone. Paper. on my phone, on yeah. My laptop's there. Right, we've been out, session one. It's mega out there. Tracks, um, it's mega, but it's so different to being back home. Even though you think you ride a bit of sandy conditions, riding out here is so different. So, considering we've got race one at a uh, deep sand track, it's much needed to come out here. What's your thoughts, Bill? Good. Nice and rough. Yeah, what's your thoughts, James? Very rough. Good boy. These are brand new. Armour Vision. I've had them on all day and look how new they are. Still brand new. Good product. But I'm going to go do another session. We've messed about all day. It's the end of the day now. Um, Bill's going to film. I'm not sure how good he's filming him. I feel like he's very close to me. But going to do a couple of laps. Been a good day so far. Improved the bike. That's it, Bill. Go film. I'll go ride. <laughs> looking for your passport <laughs> you always leave stuff Thomas not in any of my pockets good bag this one new one uh, our bag yeah I really rate it a bit for the gym there you put your dirty stuff in there saves me getting everything wet saves me getting all my clothes wet after gym and then it's got another bit for a backpack you can use it as a backpack or a duffel it's got a bit of everything Today we are riding a track in Germany called Gravenbroich. It's a track I used to ride back a lot in the CLS days. Nice tracks, like in a quarry, a few different tracks in there. One's deep sand. Little Bill should be about here somewhere. And that's it, really. There's Little Bill. Alright, Tom. Alright, Bill. Yeah. 
You had a shower? Yeah, proper nice. Big Bill don't do that. No, he just stays mucky. Stays mucky. Ben, doing a bit of work? Grafting, mate, grafting. Got proper grafting, not like us. <laughs> Messers. Oh, Luke, pulled the old laptop out as well. Yeah, I've got a copy of it, What are you doing? I've got to download your uh, Vortex stuff. New map? <laughs> New map's going in today, Thomas, to try, yep. Um, yesterday we had a little bit too much engine brake in the sand, so the friend, when I shot off the throttle, the front was diving in because we set it up around Ed's, which was really good around Ed's, loved it, but a bit too much in the sand, so Luke's going to download a different map. Hello, mate. Hello. How are we? Pissed off. Oh, can we let them all know the news on the blog? Meniscus fucked, ACL fucked, and not so fucked. So we're looking like four weeks to the op, and then a four week healing time for the meniscus, and then an ACL op, or has that changed? Um, I'm going to do it all in one go because I can't be asked to wait. I, do, I don't blame you for that. Poor Ed. What's a fucking drama. Um, all right, well, I just wanted to update your fans because they're worried about you. I'm well, a little bit worried that, about your but... mental state as well. You seem very down. But... That's me guessing at the minute. I've not even... Uh... Oh, that's your. That's you saying you're going to have an op. You've not actually spoke to the doctor about this one. Trying. I've emailed every single one going. But... Oh, Edward, Edward, Edward. This is deep sand, yeah. Don't what do you reckon like to it, it Bill? First... First glance. Looks good, yeah. Good, isn't it? Breakfast time, Thomas. Breakfast time. How are we eating this one? Cream egg. So on this trip, we had a box of 52, didn't we? 52 cream eggs. 52 cream eggs. I ate seven at the track yesterday. How many? <laughs> what are we doing with this one? You just show me how you eat that one. Oh, oh so you half it first. Yeah, and then lick it out. <laughs> I've never seen that way. Yeah, I've never seen that way. Everyone has a different technique, but we're going to go over the techniques in this vlog of how you should eat your cream egg, and we're going to rate it, and we're going to go through a full box of 52 between us. There you go, mate. There you go. All right, so how I'd eat it, generally, is just, I just bite the top off. Um, suck a bit of the cream out to start. Might have to fast forward this bit. And I tongue punch you straight in. <laughs> suck it out a bit. Oh, like yeah. the cream. You yeah, don't fill yourself up on them. We well, want to see how you eat your cream egg. Buy me one, I'll show you. <laughs> how do you eat yours? <laughs> one go. As easy as that. Gone. Gone. Gone, John. We're running low. I want to give one. I'm going to go ask Hendo. Yeah. Hendo's a seasoned mechanic, won multiple GPs, won multiple AMA national championships. But what we want to find out. Is how he eats his cream egg. Is how he eats his cream egg. Yeah. I've got. Tommy, a I want to. I want to ask you a question. Go on, Tommy. I've told them all. You're a seasoned mechanic. Won multiple AMA national championships. Mike Brown was your AMA national championship win, wasn't it? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, how many GP wins you have as a mechanic? None. No GP wins. No GP wins. There's still time. But what I want to know from you is how you eat your cream egg. <laughs> This is how I eat my cream egg, okay? I unwrap it like this. Yeah. And then I don't waste any time, I just put it in whole. Straight in? Right in. <laughs> Thank you very much and happy Easter. Don't you tell me what I shouldn't think Or I might just lose my mind If this isn't really happening
on pit board duties? Not good enough. Not good enough. Tell him. Cream egg time. Cream egg time. You good, got good one on your nose. What's that? Good work. I ain't got none with me. Oh, right. I left them back at the van. I'll tell you what. I feel like Heffrey Jerling's out there. I think the track tends to make you feel better than you are, but I feel fucking good either way. Good. These look good. Oh, really good. Armour um, vision strips. Still going. If you buy some, put on the notes in your order that I sent you there because it's just nice, isn't it? Then they think I'm a doer, top doer. But they're very good. I've had these on yesterday and today. A little white, brand new, saves using tear offs. I'm Greenpeace, I like to save the environment. Every time he leaves a mess, just stuff scattered everywhere. Skipping rope. Oh my god! <laughs> what, mate? <laughs> what happened, Luke? Where's <laughs> the just the air, so How good was that? Luke, when you back brake wheelie, you've got to have your foot no, no, over the back. No, no, we just back. over there filling up, mate. You know what you're about, that. I've seen that coming like five minutes ago. Right. <laughs> Luke just fucking done a wheelie. <laughs> fell off the back. Whoa. Gravel oh. rush. Gravel rush. Three bag all down. Four fifty is hard, hard work, mate. Have you bent my rad? I think you might have bent the rad. I tell you what, you need no, to use a green bag. Quick, we won't tell Sam and Mark. No, she ain't bent. Are you sure? Yeah. Look here, you donut. <laughs> You're the donut, mate. <laughs> you in the cream egg. Another cream egg. Yeah. How many is this today? Oh, it's got to be about. Seven. <laughs> Seven before midday. Yeah. Stop filming my rider. <laughs> I'm gonna put something on Facebook later. Oh yeah, what's that to do? One. I can't tell you. Secret. Don't tell Bill. Don't tell Bill I use his products. We don't want to promote them. No. Ben's down now. <laughs> joking. All right, we'll try that. All right, thank you. Wait. Who was that? You're not eating another cream egg. Michael, I hate it. Mm. <laughs> I only just stopped being sick from the last one. This is just one, this is everything a man needs to ride a motorbike, right here. You literally, this I'll, is... I'll, sit, I'll talk you through what we've got here. So we've got yesterday's washing. So I'm going to add to that. And then in here we've got a little goodie bag. This is what Sophie left here. we got... Oh, I've gone through them. This one was nice. We had two caramel, a white chocolate cream egg and a normal cream egg. Lovely. you got a set of boots, we've got knee braces, we've got... A, a wash bag with clean clothes. You've got a dry robe to keep you warm. You've got a kit bag. Under uses a mat. Dry robe uses a mat, which I'm not really happy about because it's actually a brand new dry robe. Wouldn't recommend doing that to a, something you paid 160 quid for. Bananas. Some nuts. This is not honey. That's actually something that you take before motors and it gives you a bit of energy. Hammer nutrition extra light. Manu bar. Bit of roll on. All wet. Nurofen, feel a bit of pain. We got it all. There's nothing here that a man don't need for a trip to Holland to ride motorbikes. I'll pack just, it up. Just a big area. Okay, we're having off, peak. Oh, lens cap, I'll be looking for that later. Yeah, 100%. I'll take that. Put that back on. Yeah, that's done some, that's done some crap, isn't it? What are you watching, Lukey like boy? Oh, Bill Dog's vlog. Yeah, uh, Bill Dog's vlog. Got to keep him the support, is Breakfast. Is that what you've had? Let's go. Driving glasses are on, let's go. See what the day brings. Them glasses need removing from your face. No, they're I'm good. I'm not walking about with you like that. <laughs> well, you got to. What? what? you reckon they look better on Luke? Yeah, they don't suit you. You really? look like a school teacher. Yes, yeah, what I thought. I said I looked like a school teacher. Dear old woman. You do look like a school teacher, yeah. <laughs> Obviously not one, because this kid's it. thick as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Where 
We're at Lommel, Lommel, and we're a vlogger. We're, recording. we're gonna go look at the track. Well, today we're at Lommel. It is the gnarliest sand track in the world. And it's quite rough already, so a little warm up, then try some bits with my suspension, then a moto, then head home. We've got the tunnel booked at eight, so you're gonna film some good footage, Bill. Yeah. Or are you riding or filming? Riding. K-Tech, all the way out here in Belgium. Tommy's new shock setting, thank you. No, I'm trying to make my shock better today. I like the forks. Shock, I need to improve. New clutch for Bill. Ben's dropped the oil for Tom. The boys are on it. It's nice, mate. Going cycling. What are you doing in Belgium? Yes, yeah, just rock up to the track in Lycra. Hey, you, you look do. good, you look fast. Yeah. Really fast. Is the bike ready? Can yeah. I step in yet? Can I come and ride? Look at this. This is factory, factory, isn't it? We're in the wrong place here. What do you reckon? Well, it's like it is, isn't it? It's all a bit much, isn't yeah. it? Everyone don't want you to film them, see the old technique. Factory pulls. Jeremy Sewer. They all get a bit uptight when the camera comes out. It's all very serious here, Bill, isn't it? Yeah. You don't like it when you film their starts. What would you rate that? Five out of five. He's a good starter. Yeah, he's quite good. Would you rate that one? 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. <laughs> Lovely bit of stuff. First session done, felt great. Probably gonna do a little bit more. Was gonna mess with my suspension, but I think it actually feels really good. Everyone sort of kicks about a little bit. But overall, it's all right. I wouldn't mind doing a start myself, Luke, with some gates, but do you reckon we can just roll in? Do you well, up for a fight? You can have a bit of a scrap. If someone starts kicking off, I'll be gone. I'll be up start straight. You can just... No, Daruba says I can get on one. But um, I'll just go and Luke can fight it out with a mechanic. We'll just pick like a small one, because you're only a little dweeb, aren't you? Any big one will just flatten you. The big ones, I'll pick <laughs> The bigger they are, the harder they fall, right. Thomas. It's more washing for soap now, Bill's said my hoodie that I made wasn't cutting the mustard so he wants me to change gear because he's gonna get reckons he's getting top footage that is gonna be go viral and he says I need to change gear so it's full factory you gotta wear all the <sighs> nice gear yeah, but the boots are gonna ruin it and that top's wet I just took this top off because I'm soaking wet what are you doing down there mate the old shoulder loosening it up Bill Track. Yeah. 
Yeah, everywhere. You can get a good lap and you can get a bad lap, but I feel really comfortable, that's the main thing. Yeah, here I found lurking in the sands of Lommel, the sand king himself. Yes. Marek Yeah. Rua! For the average viewer, rides their bike a bit. What would you say is the main thing they can do in the sand? The biggest mistake they all make is to go hard into the corner. Yeah. So the more fast you go in, the more slow you come out. Yeah, because you bury the bike. You bury the bike, you go one gear lower out of the corner, your suspension don't work, you cannot help the bike. Slow in is fast out. That's the biggest one you say. Okay. Don't kill the berm. Kill it outside the berm. Out of the berm, I mean. All right. They've heard I'm in town. <laughs> he's drove oh, sorry, out yeah. to watch the comp. Oh, he's Head's low, he's just watched now. and just thought, fucking hell, I have absolutely no chance he's this year. He's van der back this year, is he? He's bought, been in the shop this morning, bought whey protein for 49 euros. Mm. What are you doing, measuring it out? Yeah, so 500. Cream egg. Oh, no! <laughs> Why did you do that? Why would you do that? <laughs> That's good recovery. I need that after three days. You have one, then let I have one. Luke's on the cream egg, finishing the trip with one. Ride nutrition, mate. Right, Bill, let's wrap this up. We've had a great trip out here, three days riding. Absolutely loved it. We're gonna head back now, go to the tunnel, to the team workshop, split ways. Probably get home about midnight, but um, all in all, mega day. You made my week, Luke, wheeling that bike. I think all in all we just had a good week. It's been a very good week. Now back to the workshop. We'll catch you next time. See you in a bit.